crazy. Ready? Yeah. Oh, shoot. Seems like there's less room than last time. Oh my gosh. We're really gonna do this? It's what? crazy how hard it gets to breathe. No, we all no, 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 no. Back to oh. the oh. This is bad. It gets huge. What if you just lift your head into like a, a nest? No, I can see it. That's what's gonna happen. Mikey, where are you? Oh. Oh. I can hear things back there. Oh my guy. gosh, he goes further. What? Whoa, and he gets deep. Whoa, there's a bigger room. Ugh. What the heck? It just keeps going. I wonder how dark it is there. Turn off my light. This episode is sponsored by Raycon. This year, Raycon is turning six, and as a thank you for all the support, they're having a huge anniversary sale with 20% off their entire site and selected items up to 40% off. This past year, Raycon has expanded by bringing you Raycon Home and Raycon PowerTech. While I love all their products, my favorite would have to be the old faithful, the everyday earbuds. What I like most about them is you can choose your sound profile based on what you're listening to. You can go with the pure sound, the balanced sound, or the bass sound by just clicking this button. That being said, there's so many other features to make them the best. Let me show you. Their everyday earbuds are known for delivering high quality audio, a 32 hour battery life, and a seamless in-ear fit. They're Siri and Alexa compatible and super easy to pair with Bluetooth. Once paired, you can go up to 33 feet away from your phone and still have top quality sound. All of these features and still half the price of other premium brands. No wonder they've already racked up 78,000 five star reviews. And the best part is they don't budge no matter what you're doing. Did you know that? I love wearing my Raycons when I'm working on a truck because they're super comfortable even in all these awkward positions. Celebrate Raycon turning six with their biggest offer of the year going on right now. Go to buyraycon.com slash off the ranch and use code birthday for 20 to 40% off their entire site. That's buy buyraycon.com slash off the ranch and use code birthday for 20 to 40% off. Thanks to Raycon for sponsoring this video. You guys ever gone on an adventure where you're super scared and you think something bad might happen, but then Clint finds a good luck token as soon as you get there. Right outside the truck, freaking horseshoe. That's how you know we're gonna have good luck today. Also, we found another cave, Just we just got out of the truck and there's a freaking hole in the ground right here. We've never been to this spot. And there's just a hole right there. We need to get this tree out of the way. It looks like it goes down. I bet there's holes everywhere out here. Found some blueberries. Oh, we should, taste one. We should definitely eat them for energy in the cave. <laughs> Also, I feel like if you move this rock, there'd be a hole under it. We're trying to find the big cave because we, we got rope this time. We got more lights. We have a survival bag. We're going all the way in. We want to see. I haven't been able to sleep at night. I know Mikey hasn't been able to sleep at night. Is there a path right here? Kind of. We want to know what the heck is at the end of that tunnel. And I'm not getting scared of crickets this time. Is this a path? It's a path, right? This, what if it was a horse trail? This does look like a little trail. We came from the other side before looking for that cave. I think if we come from this side, it'll be faster to get there, but we don't know. We're trying to find it. Mikey looks lost. We need to go straight that way. Dude, I didn't think about the cliff. Is there a cliff? Oh no, we can get down this. We got four wheel drive. Cave? Maybe a cave. Stuff like this just like, makes me want to just spend like a day just digging to see Whoa, what we can find. You just hire someone full time for an entire year to come out here and just look for caves. Whoa. And work on digging them out. I did not slip. That was a mountain lion. You guys didn't see it. It was off camera. It attacked me. Master plan. Areas like this, we just clear out a little area for a single cabin and then a little further away where you can't see them, like they're not close enough to see, there's woods in between them, another cabin. We just have cabins all down here. So people can come out here, drink their morning coffee, watch the sun come up, all alone out in the woods. You can go climbing, not falling. That... Mikey, don't, we need your legs for the cave. Ow, ow. <laughs> just hit me in the crotch. Yeah. This is really pretty. So think about this, but like, you know, tidied up, get all like the briars cleaned up and grass mowed and just a little play area out here under the trees. I mean, look at this big old oak tree right here. It's so pretty. I think we're close to the cave. So we're down to the bottom of the valley now. It starts going up, so we need to figure out if it's that way or this way. The hiking trails, they're gonna be to die for. Not literally, uh, they're gonna be so good you'll wanna die. You won't die on them. 
pro you have to sign a waiver. I don't know. That that ravine's smaller than I thought it was, so I don't know if we would remember. We're lost. Um, can't find the cave. Not sure if we've been here before. But it's beautiful. And hardly anyone's died yet. Kaka! Kaka! I see it! It just got darker and more ominous as we get close. Did you really see a bat? Probably a bird. I hear it tweeting. Okay, good. Oh, we're back. Okay, now we just need to go down there and go swimming. Are, are you nervous? I'm ready to get cold. I want to see how far this thing goes. We're going till we can't go anymore. I got to know what's at the end of that tunnel. Do you have anything that hurts? Any like joints or anything? I mean, yeah, all the time, everything. This will fix it. <laughs> I actually just want to go back in there because I tweaked my neck the other day working out. And so, let's get in the water. The beautiful healing waters of the Desperado. So check this out. I was thinking more about this big concrete structure that they have built all over the top of this cave. And obviously there used to be metal right here and it's rusted away over the years. There also is a man-made wall right here. It's hard to see, but that is a bunch of rock and concrete, and there's a ravine that comes down right there. So they made sort of a dam there, and I think it was to try to get the water to not come this way and go around this way and get into this little ravine and go around. And I think this also was to keep dirt and rocks from going into the cave. So I would assume 60 years ago or more, whenever they were building all this, they dug this cave out so that they could actually get down there and then they built this wall to keep it from filling up you know whenever it floods again there's also a weird little area ugh, right here which i don't know what it is but it's obviously poured concrete a little pad if there's a trap door on top of this it looks like it's just rock I yeah a platform. yeah i don't think it's hollow it's just a solid rock platform and I don't know why. That's another day. That's what our guy who's going to live here out on the property is going to be exploring. Yeah. Hey man, dig through there. See if there's secret tunnel to gold or something under there. Oh, you know what we forgot? Shit. What? It doesn't matter. The buckets. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> we went and got buckets so we could get these rocks out of the way. Look what I found though. Whoa. Oh no. Dang it. I'm sorry, little guy. I got a little cave toad. Okay, he does he not like... He <laughs> ah! Okay. I'm gonna move my way so I don't step on him. Grab my phone so we can hook it to the GoPro. <laughs> Mikey, okay. you stress me out. I forgot about that. Um, I'm not too worried about cave crickets. I'm worried about other things that are scarier. So we brought a GoPro on like a 12 foot extendable pole and I'll be able to preview what we're seeing here so we can make sure there's not mountain cougars or possums. That's my two biggest fears. What are your two biggest fears? Nothing. Just a giant hole. Clint? <laughs> we got that. Yeah, just kidding. It's stuck. Clint got that. Yeah, I, I, did, I wasn't here last time. I just saw the video, and that hole is way smaller in real life. <laughs> snakes. That's what oh, it is. Oh, yeah. snakes. Snakes, yeah. that's the one. Like, I'd fight a mountain lion in here. I would rather <laughs> fight a mountain lion than a rattlesnake. Also, my other fear is uh, we've been blasting a lot, and I don't remember this crack up here. Y'all remember that crack? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably fine. <laughs> Who's that? Hello? Who's there? Say your name and business here. We just heard some noise behind us. Oh, oh my god, Mitch! <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> it food's coming. <laughs> Thanks how did for you that. Find us? Yeah, how'd you find it? No, it gets better, I promise. It's the gonna get colder. Getting getting your crotch in is the <laughs> hardest part though. Alright, so we got GoPro on a stick. Um, I'm just gonna screen record because I can't record. We just wanna go in, see if we can see further than what I could see last time. That looks pretty cool. I can see those. There's little bugs moving on top of the water. You can see them in there. Jeez. Is that as far as you can go? No, I can extend it out. Oh, yeah. Let's extend her out. 
I just really want to make sure it's not a possum or a rattlesnake. Or a bear. Or a bear. Just got a head, you know. Okay, we're going in. We're going deep. <laughs> <It's cool. laughs> Oh, we're losing signal. No, we? no, it's still working. All right. Oh, dude, it gets. Oh, yeah, I didn't go this far. It definitely gets. The roof gets lowered it back there. It gets lowered? Yeah. What about over here? Yeah, go to the right. Let's see if you can see anything. Oh, there's a passageway back there, too. <gasps> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Well, let's just go. Jenna said she wanted to go in first. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. Don't they make like GoPro head mounts? I don't know where mine went. Matt okay. prefers duct tape. Mm. I duct taped it to. Uh, why do you need a GoPro head mount when you have a flashlight head mount? Okay, you, you can duct tape a GoPro too. Exactly. I mean, it works. Why you did it. Ready? Yeah. Guess that means I'm going in. You got everything out of your pockets? You yeah, I just got two. Pockets? I got two flashlights that I don't know if they're waterproof, but we're gonna find out today. All right. Ugh. Yeah, these rocks are what suck. I'm gonna make a little hole here. This is when the rattlesnakes come out. Oh, yep. Cold on the old toes. <coughs> Y'all seen um, like Indiana Jones and those like ones where they're trying to find caves full of secrets, and right when the sun comes to a certain point, something happens. The sun has been creeping closer to this hole. It's coming straight through. It's gonna open up into a new world down here. I promise. Oh shoot! <laughs> <laughs> oh my oh, gosh! Just Don't chill. It. It's, it's colder than last time. I feel. Dude, it's. It seems like there's less room than last time. <laughs> Note that it rained this morning. No, it's fine. not here. Oh. It doesn't. Okay. Oh, okay, crickets. Oh my gosh! We're really gonna do this? <laughs> You're doing it. <laughs> To the of his foot. It's crazy how hard he gets to breathe. Why? It's called claustrophobia. I'm just scared. Oh. <laughs> These crickets are huge. <laughs> now that I've been sitting down here, I'm getting less scared. Yeah, it's like... My breathing is getting normal again. Acclimate a little bit. Yeah, it's not, not as cold. I think it's the cold that's making my breathing bad. Oh, these crickets. So are you Dr. Jones and I'm like the little... <laughs> Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. <laughs> Stay behind me, short round. Step where I step. Dr. Jones! Oh, what is Dr. Character! What is this? <laughs> oh, whoa. So this passage has dirt in it that definitely could be dug out. But man, you need you need something to breathe in there. It gets Oh my gosh, it goes so far. Oh shit, dude. There are 300 crickets on the ceiling. Don't look at them. You can't not look at them. Dude. Oh my! Dude, they're, they're everywhere. <laughs> Don't oh. look at me. I thought there were like five crickets. Just look down. Oh. <laughs> they're definitely gonna fall on our heads. Dude, That's a lot so of crickets. Weird. Like, it's the whole ceiling's like just... Oh god, they're everywhere! <laughs> Closed, you're fine. Dude, the, the, the ceiling is hairy with crickets. <laughs> and I don't want to knock them into the water because then they're going to be crawling all over me. But they're probably about to be crawling all over me. They're starting to move. What? Are you coming in? Yeah. I mean, like, take care of the cricket problem first. Dude, this goes so much further. <laughs> this goes so much further than I thought. Okay, hold on. Oh my god, dude, there's so many crickets. It's been like triple digit weather. I'm not used to cold stuff yet. One of them just jumped in the water. Crap, they're all gonna start jumping. <laughs> Follow the leader. Oh, oh they're all sitting there their hands down. Oh my. Okay. Don't jump in the water, please. <laughs> okay. Okay, oh, they're jumping off! Oh, they're jumping off! <laughs> Why are they jumping in the water? Dude, they're spreading out. Oh my god. Attack tactics. Oh. <laughs> Dude, what the heck are we supposed to do? Dude, luckily, I mean, <laughs> these things cannot swim. Whenever they jump and fall in the water, they're just like, they're on their side and they can't move. Oh, but they're everywhere. Yeah, should really see us. They're actually splitting up. They're all running away. 
Matt is surrounded. I am the cave cricket. The cave He's cricket. the cave cricket king. The cave cricket king. <laughs> oh my god, dude. This is bad. Oh, they're everywhere. Yeah, just so everybody knows, it's not just five. <laughs> yeah, I thought there were five and I got scared last time. There are 500. But they can't swim. So just knock them all in the water. No, then they're gonna be. Every, I'd rather them stay on the ceiling as much as possible. Oh, uh, their antennas are five inches long. Look at these antennas. <laughs> water is really cold and makes me want to pee. <laughs> I'm not gonna do it. Gosh, dude, it's getting. You raised the water when you came in. <laughs> Clint's gonna come in and y'all are gonna drown. I got bad news for you guys. <laughs> Wait, you... Oh, I got to tilt my head and breathe. Dude, it goes so far. I'm gonna get in there and drown, man. <laughs> <laughs> so, on the map, it shows that they didn't go all the way in here, they stopped. So, they don't know what's actually back here. So okay, now that I see the cave crickets, I can see why you wanted to get out. Oh, dude, it's getting... I don't know if we can go any further. Like, yeah, your your head is on the... It's definitely lower now. Like, my mouth is in the water. Yeah, your head is on the ceiling right now. Mm -hmm. is, the, is it not getting deeper? No. Well, I don't know. I mean, no, it's staying about the same, but like... I just can't... Go I can't have my head straight anymore. Oh, dude, Matt. Dude, it looks like it goes. It like, goes far. There's a crevice to the left. Yeah, to the left. Um, I'm going to uh, <laughs> I'm gonna try to get to the crevice. Okay. Oh, it goes so far. Okay. The crevice is old crickets. Crevices all crickets. Oh, well, it gets tall. It does? Yeah. Dude, we'll be able to like sit up in here. It gets huge. There's so many crickets. <laughs> Matt, I don't see you anymore, buddy. I thought you were right behind me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to focus on what's down that this way. Is, this is the hardest squat, squat. And then there's a freaking head hole through here. So we'll weird. be able to breathe yeah, well. It sounds like he's right there. What if you just lift your head into like a, a nest of crickets? No, I can see it. That's what's going to happen. <laughs> there, it's, there's a hundred crickets in this head hole. Oh, this is crazy. Dude, this is the freaking Indiana Jones tunnel in here. How does it get tall? I can't even see the ceiling up there. It's so tall. No freaking way. Yeah, it's narrow though. Yeah, Matt, do you want the pole? Well, no, I just need to get the guts to move six feet further and then I'll be able to look up. See? Yeah, I can't see it right now. It goes up. Oh, there's so many crickets right in front of me and I'm gonna have to brush them with the top of my head to get through here. Mikey, where are you? Uh, I'm just chilling. I'm starting to get cold. Ugh. Or maybe I'm just scared. These antennas are so gross. I just don't think it's deep in here because I'm freezing. Okay, shoot, dude. <laughs> oh, I'm doing it. <clears throat> Get away from me. Alright, I can see the uh I can see the roof. It's like eight feet high maybe. Eight? Yeah, it's not a big room though, it's just a narrow tall room. So three men could stand up in it? No, for sure we can stand up in it. What? Yeah. We can for sure stand in it. Are you gonna come in here? Whoa, this is crazy. No, you're not. <clears throat> okay, I'm through the worst. Hopefully. <laughs> I haven't found the rattlesnakes yet. Oh, yeah, it's. Oh. Oh. What? A cricket jumped on my ear. Oh, I thought you fell, Matt. Nope. All right, look. I'm on my knees now. Yeah, your body went like in. I thought you found the hole. No, a cricket jumped on my ear and I freaked out. Oh, dude, it's 
it's scary. There's like noise from the waves now. So I can hear things back there. Dude, it's pretty cool. Does it go further after that? I don't know. I can't see. I gotta go all the way. And I'm freezing yeah. and scared. I don't the hey, you know what's cool though? Is we'll be able to turn around and go head first out of here. Seriously? Which would be very nice. Yeah, I mean, I could turn around right now. There's tons of room. Do it right now. I bet you won't. Whoa. Oh, these crickets in the water. So gross. Dude, the water is so clear and clean. My ethnicity doesn't allow me to be. Mm, it was cold water. Oh my guy. gosh, he goes further. What? Whoa, and he gets deep. Whoa, there's a bigger room. Y'all have to come. There's a big room back here. Seriously? Yes. Whoa. Mitch, are you gonna come? Oh. Mikey. Just heard someone fall back there. Cricket? Up it? Oh my gosh, Mikey. Or a stick? Or something? <laughs> Are you okay? Deep in there. I wonder how dark it is there. Turn off my light. Whoa. Oh my god, I hate that. Did you bail? <laughs> we are uh, freaking, freaking in a cave. Uh, this is insane. I'm standing, actually. So crazy. And then I want to go down there because there's a room back there. Oh, the water's cold. Whew. But I want to make sure someone's coming with me. Because I'm still a little scared. So scary. <laughs> I don't know. I will if I can get past the cold. Yeah. <gasps> yeah. Oh shit, it's so cold. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Ah. <laughs> I told you. Matt is just used to like cold or something. I already see a cricket. Oh my god, it's so creepy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Y'all are these You're big family here. men. This is, um, I got my body halfway in this tunnel and I can't make it move <laughs> It's so cold. It's so creepy. <laughs> Mikey already failed. So Mikey said nope. <laughs> I want to go to the end, but I don't want to go by myself. There might be a mountain cougar. You're getting close. No, I have. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still at the entrance. <laughs> Get over here! Last part of the work, you have to pop your head to the side, and that's the. Uh... Mitch is doing it. <sighs> oh, whatever. This what is, a beast! This is crap. You know it's cold. Admit that it's cold, Mitch. All right. He's trying to just power through. He is powering through. Wow. Oh, he's he's moving. Claustrophobia. But also, just breathe crawl. Yeah, your breathing will get better. Where are you? Keep on coming. Are you kidding me? I see your light. I see you. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> nice. Can you stand? Yeah, you can stand up. Um, we're gonna have to duck down here, but then it opens into a bigger room. Mike, are you coming? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Woo! <-hoo. laughs> nice. Is that cool? Down there. Yeah, I guess. I can't tell. Huh. But it's running from there. Hey, I'm sure. Mitch, uh, where are you at? Yo. Where are you at? Right. <laughs> that part is the worst. Turn your head sideways. Uh, <laughs> it's just me now. This is scary. Uh, uh, 
Watch the light with your right foot. There you go. Clint's a thick boy. <laughs> you have so much dirt in your beard. <laughs> I was on my side. They said you had to go sideways to get through, and my head wouldn't fit, and water's just going in my mouth. And No. Yeah, I was like, nope, I'm not going to breathe through the water. You did it! Look at those cricket antennas. <laughs> nice. Good job, Mikey. But that's, that's a bigger room. Yeah, I'm like, I can stand up. Alright, ready? What the heck? It just keeps going. I thought this was the end. Alright, we're waiting. We're waiting. You'll see us. <coughs> yeah, we got like five more minutes. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Your heart's gonna stop. Whoa, it gets deeper. No, 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 no. Okay, this is the end. Yeah. This is the end, boys. <coughs> I wonder if it wants water out of here. <laughs> yeah. Dude, it actually goes a lot further, but I'm not going through that. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. oh, man. All right, we definitely need some cave divers to come do this. Because yeah. it goes far in there. Hey, hey, shh, listen. It's like rumbling as the waves go back there. I've been in here for like half hour waiting for y'all. Let's do it. I like how you have to get in y'all's belly. I'm just crawl. <laughs> Perks of being short, fellas. Twice as far when I finally, I don't know, maybe further than that when I pulled that rope off my feet. <sighs> yeah, good. you definitely need to get that. We made it. We survived. Um, we definitely need to get some pro cave people out here. Uh, and a lot of comments, I didn't, I've never watched these guys, but a lot of comments were saying the Adventure Twins, Aqua Chigger, those are like some caving kind of channels. Uh, yeah, you guys are welcome. If you guys want to come out and uh, go further in, we went as far as I'm comfortable going. We're gonna see if we survive this. You know, make sure we don't get any like weird brain 
like things. Yeah, yeah, or, or just explosive diarrhea. Um, yeah. we, I got a lot of cricket water in my mouth, I'll be honest. Dude, I, I, I slurped so up. I was underwater, slurping water. <laughs> so, There's this uh, one part where you have to tilt your head, and the water's right here, and I was like... <laughs> <laughs> and there's crickets all over. But hey. Crickets crawling on my We did it. We did it. Something crawled up my feet. We did it. Something, something, something crawled up my pants. What? That's, I've yeah, never seen Mikey panic. Out and backed up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's something in my pants. <laughs> 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 I'm pretty sure things are crawling up my pants. But other than that, solid. We didn't see any mountain lions, no, no rattlesnakes. I All right. Wet suit. Who wants to come uh, explore this thing? We, this is the best cave on the property that we found so far, and it's it goes way further than we're comfortable going. We found another sign on the way out. We walked out a different way. This sign says Quail Canyon, and we were walking because it looks like this is like a little road, a little trail. So we kind of are finding more trails to slowly develop. The hiking's gonna be insane. Not to die for. Just to die for. Whatever. Either. That one says lookout. And then there's obviously little rocks here, and then the lookout is right there. It's and it's rock. like some giant rocks. This place is awesome! We found another cave. Oh yeah, it goes deep. Yeah, it goes deep. Whoa! 